most people don't know how close Andy Petrie and I worked together in 93, 94, 95. We worked together as a team, the three and the 24. Ray made a lot of friends. There were certainly friends like Andy Petrie and others that Ray had worked with prior to being a full-time crew chief. Andy Petrie and I have been friends for a long time. I suggested that they hire Andy to be Jeff Gordon's crew chief because I didn't want to even be the crew chief because I didn't think I had enough experience. I wanted to be the chassis guy. I built cars, I set chassis, that's what I did. Andy Petrie made the phone call that put Jeff Gordon and I together. And then we decided we need to figure out how to pit together, we need to be able to talk to one another. In 94, we started to run good and the three car was starting to struggle. Earnhardt was battling for the championship in 94 and I go and build four shocks and give them to Andy to put on Earnhardt's car. And our car owners did not know at this time. <laughs> but we had our own private channel and we'd just switch over and talk to one another during the race. And we kind of would work together. And at the end of the race, let those guys have at it. You know, it wasn't like we were giving away tire pressure secrets or doing whatever. The championship goes to Jeff Gordon. We actually had that radio channel. We were racing each other for the championship in 95 and we're still talking. <laughs> you know?